are coming up on what would have been graduations and end of the school year events had it not been for the coronavirus. 10 News anchor Jenna Zipton talked to local families about missing out on those big moments. The Giles High School soccer season ended in heartbreak last year, losing in the semifinals. Senior Trey Jones was hoping this would be their year. We're looking like a decent team this year. So we were all really excited to get back out there. We only got to play the first two scrimmages, so, and that was our season. But now they've been out of school for six weeks and the season canceled. It's a sad situation. So, you know, a lot of people don't understand, you know, they think there's bigger issues. Yeah, there's bigger issues out there. There's, you know, way bigger issues, but to a senior, you know, this is life changing for them. Mom Natasha Merrick says they understand why, but still want milestones like graduation recognized. It doesn't have to be much, just something so that, the, you know, all the seniors can get together with their class, you know, and us parents can watch our children, you know, walk across their stage to get their diploma. She's my pride and joy. She just turned 18 in October. And she has worked really hard to graduate and to get to this point. Christy Martin's daughter Autumn goes to Bassett High School and was also looking forward to the end of the year, especially the softball season. Her senior night has so been the best. And she has never been the best at softball, but she has really, you know, turned into something really good the last two years. And she was going to shine this year. I don't like the way it all ended, but I understand they had to do that. But the senior wants to walk across the stage wearing her cap and gown. That is the one last thing that we need for closure. The families say they know this is necessary. They just want a chance for their kids to be recognized. Henry County says high schools will have their traditional ceremonies once gathering restrictions are lifted. Giles County says they're waiting until after June 10th to decide about graduation, but will do something even if they can't meet in person. Jenna Zibton, 10 News, working for you.